Right now, a community is mourning the loss of two people following a tragic accident in the Outer Banks Monday afternoon. 13 News Now reporter Ali Weatherton spoke with one man who witnessed the aftermath. Chad Connor is still in shock. He didn't see the accident happen, but he was there minutes after, and he says all he could do is pray. Something that you'll never forget. Chad Connor calls this a freak accident. And they come on vacation and they go home without a mom and dad. So how fair is that? It's not. A family of six, a dad, mom, two kids, and their grandparents were walking back to their beach house when three of them were hit from behind by a man driving a pickup truck. The only thing that came to my mind is to pray. So, so I laid hands on the boy first and then got to the mom and dad. The boy is expected to be okay, but his parents, Alan and Holly Nicolette, died. They are from Mechanicsville, and Holly is a fifth grade school teacher. Chad Connor says when he saw both of them, they were badly hurt. I was like, sir, do you know this man? He said, he's my son. So the dad was watching his son slip away right there in the road. Investigators say the man driving the pickup truck may have fell asleep or had a medical emergency. I feel for him. He's an older man, and in a split second, uh, his life will change forever also. And Connor says everyone's lives changed in an instant. He hopes everyone keeps both families in your thoughts and prayers. It just don't seem fair, you know. Sometimes it's not fair. In Kitty Hawk, Allie Weatherton, 13 News Now.